Hi, I'm Endo Doherty, and I'd like to share with you five things that I've learned during the coronavirus. The first thing is that the ordinary really is extraordinary. I'm missing the ordinary things in life, handshakes, hugs, meeting with family and friends, coffee shops, rugby, going to the theatre, things that I might have taken for granted. And when I get them back, I certainly won't do that, because I do know that the ordinary simple things in life can sometimes be truly extraordinary. The second thing I've learned is that my health is my wealth. It's cliche, but it's fact. I intend to invest far more time in my health and make sure that I accumulate that health wealth going into the future, making good choices with exercise, with diet and with sleep. The third thing that I've learned during this virus is that connections and people truly matter. People who love us, people who encourage us, people who support us in difficult times, people really, really matter. So many people from our lives have been removed because of restrictions, because of this terrible virus. And I've promised myself to call them, to email them, to FaceTime them. But when this is over, to truly connect with people. I think the fourth thing is something that I've always known, yet it's really brought it to mind. The fourth thing I've learned is that Ireland is a fantastic country, full of amazing people. As a speaker, I travel quite a bit. Uh, I travel to the UK and the States, and I, I love my holidays. And I've always known that there was something special about Irish people, the way we use language, the way we treat each other. During this crisis, what's been apparent to me is the sense of community, of selflessness, of care, of love that's apparent in this country has been fantastic. We've done the right thing and made good decisions because of our care for each other. I'm very, very proud always to represent Ireland in my travels and as a speaker. And I'm very, very cognizant that we are unique. There is something special here. And I'm very grateful to live here. The fifth and final thing that I've learned on my journey so far through COVID is fear is more infectious than the virus. I went for a walk this morning and I passed two older people. The look in fear, the look of fear in their face as we approached the look of gratitude when we walked very, very far away into the middle of the road to avoid contact. But while the virus is infectious, and while fear is truly infectious, so too is laughter, so too is love, so too is friendship, so too is energy, positivity, excitement. There are so many things that we can transmit with our words, with our body language, with our actions so many positive things that we can do to influence the people around us in our lives and we really should think about it finally thanks for watching this video my question for you is if this is three years from now and you watch this video again and you look back on COVID-19 and you ask yourself this question did I survive or did I thrive did I take a series of actions did I establish a strong mindset that saw me, my family, my company, my friends through this crisis? I think those who look back and appreciate that they thrived will be grateful for the experience and be grateful that it's passed. I hope you and your families are safe and healthy. We can do this. Thanks for watching.